What is demand response? In short, demand response is a way of rewarding organizations for using less energy when the grid is stressed or electricity prices are high. Here's how demand response works. Sometimes the demand for energy outpaces the grid's ability to supply it, which can lead to brownouts or blackouts. Instead of producing more energy at great expense to consumers and the environment, the grid can offset the imbalance by reducing the amount of electricity being consumed during times when demand exceeds supply. That's demand response, and it can be very financially rewarding to organizations like yours. Demand response programs can be offered by your local utility or your energy markets grid operator. While demand response programs vary in detail from utility to utility and from market to market, there are essentially three types of demand response programs, capacity, ancillary services, or economic. Capacity, as it relates to energy, is defined as the maximum electric output an electric generator can produce under specific conditions. Capacity programs are the backbone of demand response. They help create long-term grid stability by paying organizations to be on reserve to curtail their electric load when called upon by the grid operator to relieve stress when the demand for electricity outpaces the grid's ability to supply it. With capacity programs, the grid operator is essentially creating electricity reserve to be called on during the few times each year when the electric demand exceeds supply. Most of the time, grid operators can foresee when demand for electricity will eclipse supply. There are times, however, when loss of generation or transmission failure occurs due to inclement weather or other emergencies that can't be predicted. When these unforeseeable circumstances take place, ancillary services can be called to quickly restore balance to the grid. Ancillary service demand response programs pay organizations to be on call to make quick energy reductions in response to sudden short-term grid instability. They are similar to capacity programs, with the exception that participating organizations must curtail within short notice of being called on by the grid operator, typically within 10 to 30 minutes. The price of electricity can rise or fall for any number of reasons. Economic demand response programs pay organizations to reduce their electricity consumption when market prices become especially high. Participants are notified when wholesale electricity prices are high and reduce their electric consumption, thereby minimizing the impact of price spikes, reducing the need for expensive capacity generation, and help keep prices stable in the market. Economic demand response participants also have the potential to significantly save on energy costs due to reduced consumption during these periods of high electricity prices. Now that you know what demand response is and what the three types of DR programs are, which program is right for you? That's where C Power comes in. C Power and our team of energy experts work closely with organizations like yours to develop a complete demand side energy management strategy consisting of the optimal combination of demand response and demand management programs, as well as distributed energy resources. Now you know about demand response and how it can help your organization earn money. Watch the next video in C Power's Demand Side Energy Management 101 series to learn about how peak demand management can help you save money on your electric bill. And if you have any questions or are ready to get started with demand side energy management, give us a call or click the Get Started button, and one of our Sea Power Energy experts who's intimately familiar with your state and market will help you find your way.